everyone, Monroe Steele here from Fashion Steel NYC, and welcome back to my channel and my birthday vlog. Make sure to give your girl a thumbs up and subscribe if you love fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and travel videos. As you can see, my phone is already blowing up um, <laughs> because today is yacht day. That's why I'm in my favorite bikini from Rat and Boa. You guys have seen this before. I actually just wore it not too long ago to a cabana day at the Ritz Carlton um, Ball Harbor. So yeah, it's almost my birthday. My birthday is on May 15th, which is a Monday. It's also the day after Mother's Day. And so I wanted to celebrate early. And so I'm doing a yacht day, like I always do. Mm -hmm. All of the like boat details will be down below because I get so many questions of people that are coming to Miami, even though I link literally every place I ever go in every vlog and I have numerous travel guides on my blog, fashionstillnyc.com for Miami, I get hundreds of DMs every day. And honestly, at this point, like I can't get to them all. And so your best bet for coming to Miami is to head over to my website. There's a link down below. Head to travel. In any place I've ever traveled, there's a guide. For Miami, there's at least five. So yeah, check those out, but I will put the details to the boat down below. Um, Y'all need to start watching these vlogs and creating the list of all the places I go because I link them all in the, in the description box. Anywho, it's gonna be a really fun day. All of my friends are coming out. We are going to turn up on this yacht, but I need to rewind it back because I did promise you all another day in New York. And y'all love a New York Miami vlog. So I'm gonna rewind it back to the other day <laughs> before I flew in from New York. I spent a day doing a ton of work. I did a little bit of shopping on Fifth Avenue. I did a job with Mugler Fragrances for their new Angel Elixir. I also did some work with Michael Kors at Rockefeller Center. Um, and it was a really fun day. And it really gives you the tea on like, how hard it is to be an influencer sometimes when you have just like so many jobs and you're you're juggling so many things and i really wanted to show you guys like the tedious things like me staying up until one o'clock in the morning to edit <laughs> um which is not a usual occurrence but this is the busy season so let's rewind it back to my last day in new york and then we'll come back here and we will go party on the yacht hi guys so I rewound it back for you all. We're here in New York still. Um, I'm about to head to Herald Square in front of Macy's to check out the Mugler fragrance pop-up. I'm actually working with them. I have to make a TikTok for them uh, showing the activation and introducing their new Angel Elixir perfume. Uh, so the bottle is a beautiful, like deep blue. Um, and it represents like the Milky Way. Uh, so I put on this blue dress from the Something by Sanji Monroe Steel fall collection from I believe 2022 and it matches the bottle perfectly. This is our Beyonce dress. Do you guys remember this one? By the way, our new collection is dropping on May 19th, which I believe will be this upcoming Friday. So I have on a full Dior face. I have on the Dior uh, eyeliner, I mean eyeshadow. You guys seem to love this eyeshadow. It's a beautiful like red almost. And um, my code for Dior has been updated. It is Monroe23, all capital letters, for a free gift with purchase over $125. Um, when you sign up for a Dior account, all you have to do is just put in your email. Um, so yeah, definitely check out my Dior favorites down below in the description bar. Uh, my beauty favorites, perfume favorites, gift sets, candles, all of the things, and the code is Monroe23. So let me show you what Mugler sent me the other day. They hand delivered me their newest fragrance. So let me grab it. It's right here. So I always feel like super special when they hand deliver things. <laughs> I think it's just so cool. But I went to the Mugler event here in New York City, the Mugler H&M event, and they also sent me a beautiful bouquet of flowers if you guys watched that vlog, and this fragrance. But they sent this one so that I could work with this for the campaign. 
yeah and it smells really really good i think i told you guys the notes last time but it's like a peppery very kind of mysterious deep like i feel like if the galaxy had a, a smell <laughs> like out in space this is what it would be slightly sweet a little bit of a little bit of peppery a little masculine um let me show you guys the bottle if i can ever get this open it's like chow food. okay so here it is you all know that all of their bottles look like a star So here's the bottle. It's a really deep blue. Sometimes it almost looks black, but in the light, it's definitely blue and it matches this dress. So yeah, we're gonna pack this up, head down to the activation. I'm gonna show you guys. Hopefully it's still going on by the time this video goes live. I'll put the details down below. If you're in the New York area, you can pop by Herald Square and check it out. Tell them Moreau sent you. Um, let me show you my outfit and then we'll head down. All right, guys. So here is my outfit for the event. This is the Beyonce dress from the Something by Sanji Monroe Steel fall collection. I, I don't believe this dress is available anymore. We sold out, um, but it was one of our best selling dresses of all time with this unique design. So, yeah, I'm matching the bottle trying to stay on brand which is perfect and then right after this we have some downtime so we might do a little shopping and then I have a campaign with Michael Kors which is in store so I'll be taking you guys in store showing you the offerings trying on a few things showing you my favorites from Michael Kors uh, it's a really busy day let's go
just wrapped up my content. I just uh, sent off my Mooglare TikTok. And you guys would have just seen it because I would have inserted it for you. But now we have a few hours to burn before I have to do my in-store Michael Kors um, campaign at Rockefeller Center. So Maria and I are just gonna go do some window shopping. Or real shopping. <laughs> We will, we'll see. But this dress came in handy. It's like the perfect color for the Mugler campaign. Get ready for brunch with me in this full Michael Kors look. This necklace is so dainty, it makes the perfect gift. Speaking of gifts, check out the 25% off Mother's Day event at Michael Kors. This dress is super lightweight and I love that it has pockets and a built-in belt. These platforms are sky high, but they are super comfortable and also come in black. Everyone needs a white purse for spring and this one is very chic. Head to Michael Kors to shop the 25% off Mother's Day event. Hey y'all. So I am back from shooting my Mooglera campaign. It's already live. After that, we did some shopping in Zara. We went to Saks. I tried on these super cute um, jeans. I forgot the brand. Palm Angels. Very, very cute jeans. I'll link them down below. I'm probably going to end up getting them. I just wanted to check the sizing. And then we went across the street 
and we shot in store at the Michael Kors store, which was really fun. We got to check out the bags, the new shoes. They have this new raffia bag that's really, really cute. And a few things that we thought would be great for gifts for Mother's Day. Uh, so if you're interested in anything that you saw, because I overlaid that as well, the reel that we created for Michael Kors, uh, I will link everything down below and a few of my favorites from Michael Kors, including things that I already own. I have quite a few dresses from them, really cute heels and a few bags as well. Uh, so yeah, they had a 25% off everything from Mother's Day. I don't think that will still be going on, but even so, I'll link a few of my favorites from Michael Kors down below. So now we are back and now I have to shoot another campaign. <laughs> I have to shoot another Michael Kors campaign. I'm not, I'm not mad at it. I'm just a little tired. So I had to go pick up the package from an access point. Um, this one is also to promote Mother's Day, but not in store, just online. So yeah, I'm gonna quickly make a like, get ready with me reel uh, and record a few stories and then I will finally be done with work for today, finally. <laughs> Can't wait to relax. Tomorrow we fly out back to Miami, first thing in the morning, 6 a.m. So yeah and i also haven't really eaten today and it's five o'clock actually it's 5 30. actually it's 5 40. but food is on the way that was the food there oh it's here great so i would check back in with well actually since we rewound it back i'm gonna go back to present day now um but yeah day in life all right guys so i hope you enjoyed that day with me in new york city all of those things that i wore the places i went and such are linked down below um i did pop into zara um, and I tried on some really cute jeans, so I'll link those down below as well. So I'm running a little bit late. What's new? Here's a better look at this set, although you've seen it. It's a two-piece bikini and a little uh, skirt that goes with it. I also have a top that goes with it as well. It's beautiful. It's sheer. It's kind of like off the shoulder. Very, very sexy. Um, I'm going to pack this up as well. This is my new bag. I'm a hot commodity today, y'all. Anywho, this is my new bag. This is my new Reeve Gauche tote that I got from my Teresa. It's so cute. I wanted it for uh, LA, but it didn't come in time. Uh, you guys know I have another one. This one is Black Raffia. It's also canvas. This one has buttons at the top to close it, which is really cool. And this one's a little bit smaller. I think it's more chic, a little more dainty. This is my other one that I always travel with. And I mean, this one is great for airport travel for sure, but like for daily use, if you need to pack a lot of things, this one's great. In here, I have like two outfit changes, um, some other swimsuits, my makeup, a few pairs of sunglasses because y'all know we gonna, <laughs> we're going to have a fashion show on the yacht for sure. So yeah, I have this all packed. I hardly ever wear my Loewe sunglasses, so I thought these would be cute for the boat. I'm not going to take any, any earrings because I always end up taking them off. Um, they have a great dupe at Amazon of these, so I'll link them down below in case any of you are interested today's boat fragrance is baccarat we are we're we are manifesting rich and this is rich b smell <laughs> baccarat rouge 540 tate noir 29 from lalabo my favorite little mixture i already sprayed it on i smell so good but i'm gonna pack one because i am going to change outfits at some point all right i think we'll pack this one and i am already in fact i have to go put on some uh lotion because i don't have on any but i'm feeling very cute today i did my little baby hairs and it's a vibe by the way i have um linked the girl the woman sorry who did my hair she's so sweet and kind she actually came to me to do my hair she does travel um her name is Brittany, and her instagram is slade.studio so if you're in the Miami area, definitely check her out. She took her time. It didn't hurt. And yeah, I love my hair. <laughs> this is like my new favorite style. 
all right guys let's go put on some lotion let's call an uber let's get the cups that we're drinking out of and then we have to go run 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 and pick up the food and then head to the boat all right let's go the thing is everybody's calling me and i'm busy like i gave y'all all the details for y'all to be at the boat on time no need to reach out um i'll see y'all there okay let's go put on some lotion and where oh i'm gonna pack my sandals as well from melissa i have been wearing these sandals non-stop like i'm so glad that they sent them to me they are super comfy they can definitely be worn on a boat even though we're going to take the shoes off once you're on the boat i wore these pretty much the whole time i was in la i love them so i've linked them down below shout out to melissa shoes for sending these super cute bubble sandals all right guys what's we're, up we're on the way this is your first time being in the vlog oh wait you honored no I, th I feel like you were in the new year's vlog too but just like barely yeah <laughs> this has been what's up guys and this is ria hey. and we're on our way yeah. all right Tay. <laughs> cheers Yay. to to a real one's birthday yes, yes. Yes. Happy Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's cute. Oh, I, love the color. I love it. Money green, I, baby. And it's my favorite green. color. Green. The research. The research. <laughs> the green. <laughs> the research. I'm screaming. Not the picture. We're in the caption. You're like, my favorite like, color is green. Um, we're yeah, like, oh, yeah. that's me with my color. <laughs>
so today is a new day today is actually mother's day so shout out to all the mothers and the mother figures out there making life easier for their children and surrogate children um yeah i had a nice long combo with my mom today and you know sent her a nice little gift Mm-hmm. I always tell my mom that I'm the gift because my birthday is so close to Mother's Day that like I'm, I'm the gift that keeps it on giving. I'm like the best gift she could ever get. She don't need nothing else. Um, and I thanked her for birthing me. <laughs> but yes, um, yesterday on the boat was incredible. I had so much fun with my friends. We turned up. We ate, we drank, we danced, we laughed, we had deep conversations, which is really weird for like a boat ride. But that's the point where, you know, everyone is in their lives who were on the boat. We were all just like contemplating life and the lessons we've learned in the years we've been alive and uh, the takeaways that I've learned from this past year, which is really just to surround myself with supportive encouraging positive people um and that has really made my life better um and also just following my dreams and not having fear i was having this conversation this conversation with maria not too long ago about how hard it is to give up control especially when you're a very type a control type of person like i am um and just just give things over to god um uh, now i'm much older than maria so <laughs> i had to let maria know that it's okay to be fearful and to have fear of the unknown like how are things gonna work out where is this money gonna come from how am i gonna get through this loss or through a grief or through a breakup or through this hardship how am i gonna get past not having any money how 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 am i gonna do this i i i there's a lot of i in that as well and uh i've just learned throughout the years that anytime i've had fear like that god always comes through every single time i might not know how it's gonna work out but god always makes a way and i've lived so long well not so long but i've lived long enough to have so many testimonies and moments like that in my life where i have been completely broke like completely broke and this was not that long ago like when i was in school when i was in graduate school i mean my parents didn't have money like that to like send me to school i had to take out so many loans um i was not allowed to have a job during school but i got one anyway because i would have no money <laughs> like i i couldn't live um and i remember one day going to a job interview i didn't have enough money to take the train in new york city and the train is only like you know two dollars like i didn't have enough money in my bank account to take the train so i walked from 22nd street to i believe Times square like 42nd street i started early so i can get to the job interview on time um and I remember I got there a little early and I was like, check it. I wanted like a, I wanted a hot chocolate from Starbucks. So I checked my bank account. I had, I didn't even have enough in my bank account to get a, a coffee, to get a hot chocolate. And I remember just sitting there in the Starbucks. I just got a cup of water and sat there and waited for my job interview. I ended up getting that job. Thank God. That job got me through my first year of PT school. Um, and then on my way back home, which I also walked, um, I found $20 blowing on the ground and I couldn't believe it. Like I was just walking. I was thinking like, how am I gonna like survive until I get my first paycheck? And I was walking and literally just $20 just blew across the, right across my feet. And I knew it was nothing but God because I, I needed, <laughs> I needed money and I've had so many instances. Well, it things like that have happened not just involving money but just involving things that i don't know how it's gonna work out like and i'm scared and god has always come through every single time if you live long enough and you're a christian you believe in god it'll happen like it'll happen so many times that it gets to a point where you're just not feel fearful anymore i mean you are fearful but you already know that god is gonna work it out like everything is laid out for you um so yeah i didn't mean to get all deep 
and, 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 and throw a testimony in there. But if you're just in a spot in your life and you're just wondering how you're going to get through it, know that God is always going to come through. And he may not be there when you want him, but he'll be there right on time, right in the nick of time. So yeah, that's what me and Maria were talking about and kind of what we were talking about on the boat yesterday about just life and how wonderful it is to be alive and to be able to learn these lessons and experience life in this time right now. Um, yeah, so great day. I love my cake. It was actually a pistachio cake and it was my favorite color. Like Rhea and the girls, they did it for me. Like. They know your girl loves pistachio. They know my favorite color is green. I got some gifts. I'll show those gifts to you guys soon. But I'm about to head to lunch or actually brunch at Soho Beach House. They're having a Mother's Day brunch. So Rhea and I are about to roll through. I got myself together there. A super quick face. I'm wearing the CoverGirl Yummy Gloss. I love this gloss. Now for the look. I had to bust it out y'all this is the two-piece set from the something by sanji collection it's actually not a set it's a reversible top on the other side is this beautiful cream color um brown color that matches the cargo skirt that you all love so much and i just paired it with the paper bag black shorts a lot of you have are asking if the belts come with it yes the belt comes with the pockets from the belt are removable so you don't actually need to have them on but we love the cargo look so we added these little pockets but they are removable and the, these shorts have pockets on their own there is an elastic waist and everything in the collection that you see me in i'm wearing a medium this collection is true to size it drops on may 19th 12 p.m eastern standard time 9 no no 9 a.m uh la time so let me show you the full look okay hopefully you can see me but wearing these paper bag shorts i love them they are so chic and i think this is perfect for just like a little day at soho pool house plus i can advertise that hey the collection is dropping y'all should buy it but yeah i'm wearing a medium you can take the pockets off the belt the belt does come with and then i'm wearing the reversible crop top that ties in the back super cute i love this so yeah, you can even turn it over on the other side and it's this color. This is the cargo skirt. So I would highly recommend getting the top because you can wear the top with the shorts and then you can turn it over and wear the same top with the cargo skirt from our collection. Yeah, mm. I should probably wear some sunglasses from our collection too. We have the Sonora Shield sunglasses from our collection. And they have these like super cool, almost like marble in black and white. And then we have like a, like a marble, almost like a cheetah print. I hope these are coming across. These are my favorite from the collection. And then we also have these as well from the collection. Let me turn the brightness down so you can see them. Cause these are really, really cool. They're like a brown with almost like a pinky brownish tint super cool we also have this brown pair of the sonora shield sunglasses there you go you can see the color i'm gonna wear these because i think i'm gonna wear my brown louis vuitton sandals and these will go perfect ah i love this look that is it sunglasses are from our collection they come in a ton of different colors i showed you the black and white ones the orange and marble ones we have brown we have a full black one and this full something by Sanji Monroe Steel Spring Summer Desert Oasis Collection set dropping May 19th on somethingbysanji.com. Sanji is spelled S O N J I A.com. Everything is linked down below. All right, let's go to brunch. So I'm going to switch to my phone to take you guys with me to brunch because I don't want to roll up to Soho House with a camera and get kicked out. <laughs> All right, let's go.
So I am back from my little outing today. Um, we tried to go to Soho Beach House, but they had actually had last call. So they closed down the like brunch bar and everything and they were getting ready to close, which I didn't know was a thing. So we ended up going to Red Rooster, one of my favorite restaurants here in Miami. Um, and it was really nice, even though like it was Mother's Day, it wasn't that packed. And we got the cornbread, which is always delicious. We got some champagne. We got the double eggs, which are so good. And then both Rhea and I got the oxtail pepper bowl with uh potatoes the potatoes were like mashed potatoes with garlic and chive and uh some plantain and it was pretty good like i can't front i got the itis <laughs> your girl is sleepy okay and everyone loved my fit uh you know what let me give you guys the proper names of everything um i am going to create a a specific video just for the clothing line before it drops on May 19th but everything does like have a name and such so let me find the names of everything because we came up with them pretty not last minute but everything has a meaning so I already told you about the Sonoran shield sunglasses these are the brown ones and they're so cute And these are like perfect for the neutral girl who has lots of browns and beiges and whites in your wardrobe. But like everybody needs a pair of brown sunglasses. And these are really fire. You can almost see like the tint on the lens is slightly yellowish brown. They're so beautiful. I love them. So those are the Sonoran Shield sunglasses. And then we have two styles this time. The second style we have are these, and these are the Gobi sunglasses. By the way, everything in the collection is named after a desert. These are fire. These are clear. They're like a clearish brownish with kind of an orangey pinky lens. Dang, I could have wore these too. These are fire. So we have two shapes, and then each of those styles comes in a ton of different colors. So this crop top is actually called the Mojave Halter Top. And it's a halter because you can tie it around the neck a few different ways. It's open in the back, super cool. This top has darts here and it can go with these paper bag shorts as well as the cargo skirt. Since it's right here, let me just hold it up for you. Everyone love this cargo skirt. Like it's too good. So the other side, if I flip it inside out, is this color. So getting the top is a no brainer if you plan on getting the shorts or the skirt because you can wear it with both. Again, if I flip this inside out, turn it around, it's the same color. Um, the, the paper bag shorts are called the Kalahari, the Kalahari paper bag cargo shorts. And again, it comes with the belt with the pockets and these are removable so we try to do like a lot of cargo styles because those are really the cargo trend is really big right now um and just minimal um neutral colors so yeah check out the collection may 19th it's dropping uh size extra small to a 3xl and everything um, it is true to size, though, with your normal size. There will be a size chart for each piece in the collection. This collection is spot on true to size. So go with your normal size and everything. Again, the shorts on these have an elastic waist. And you really cinch it in with the belt to give that paper bag look. You can also just flip it down and wear it kind of like a tulip skirt as well. We also made the shorts a little bit longer than the previous shorts. Um, just for a little more modesty, you're not really showing anything if you bend over. Um, and just to make them a little more chic. So yeah, that's the collection. That's what I did today. 
Um, I'm gonna start a new vlog to show you guys everything I got for my birthday, which is a lot. <laughs> I'm doing another My Teresa haul. You guys know I'm working with My Teresa. So I got a few things from My Teresa, including this bag. I'll probably show this again in the video. I love this tote. It is the perfect size. Ugh. I'll link this down below because this came in so clutch yesterday for the yacht day and it's just very very chic i feel like the black one with the raffia and like the neutral writing is a lot more chic than the other one and plus this one won't get it dirty so quickly as well and the smaller size too because it's not huge the other one i definitely love for traveling so yeah i end up showing you guys everything i got in from my Teresa. i got a new bag um, and I got a ton of gifts from brands too. So I think the next video will be the what I got for my birthday video. I hope you guys are excited about watching it as I am about creating it, which will probably happen tomorrow. All right, so thank you all for the birthday wishes. By the time this video goes live, my birthday would have passed already. But a lot of you have already sent super sweet messages on Instagram, on TikTok, as well as in the comments of my previous YouTube videos. So thank you all so much. I am very, very happy. I had a wonderful birthday. Well, my actual birthday hasn't happened yet, but the pool day, I mean, but the yacht day with all my friends was great. Um, and for my actual birthday, which is tomorrow, I just plan on relaxing. I'm not gonna do any work. <sighs> no work for me no work mondays well actually i have a meeting with my assistant but other than that i'm not working i'm probably just gonna go to the beach and get a chair and just bask in the sun and go frolic in the ocean and really just connect with myself and you know write down all the things that i'm grateful for and all of the things that i'm looking forward to in this next year of life all right guys so I hope you enjoyed the video. Everything you've seen in today's video is linked down below in the description box for you guys. I do have an updated code with Dior Beauty. The code is now Monroe23, all capital letters, for a free gift with purchase over $125 when you create a account, an account at Dior, which is pretty easy once you check out, just put in your email and things. Um, and then you get a free gift with purchase. And I have gone ahead and linked my favorites from Dior Beauty down below. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for the birthday wishes. Happy Mother's Day. I will see you all in the next one. Make sure to thumbs up, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a video. All right? Bye, guys.